Hey, it's Jennifer Kennedy, all the way from Kamloops, British Columbia, Canada. The sun is shining, it's a beautiful day. We've got our Connecting Hearts campaign on right now, and I'm here to share a little bit about building your team and what's working really well for us. So I'm gonna talk a little bit about passion, I'm gonna talk a little bit about where you can look, how you can do this, and then some words to say and some things that have worked great for our team in the past. So, um, passion. We all know why we love beauty control, right? You don't need to convince each other. We know we love it. We're always super excited. We know the minute women try mascara, they see instant results. We know that when they try the tight firm and fill, we see their lines filling in. So share your passion. Make it part of who you are. Beauty control is part of my life. I talk about it all the time. It's just part of who I am. It's what I do, right? So make sure you're sharing your passion and that passion needs to come through a lot of times in a phone call. Sometimes, you know, texting, it's hard to sort of put all capitals and exclamation marks, right? So make sure that you're picking up the phone, but share your passion for the products because you know why you love them and you wanna make sure that you're sharing that with others. So how do you do this? Who do you look for? So when I very first started my business, I did a frank list for hostesses, like we always teach everyone, but I also did a frank list for people that I thought could use beauty control in their lives. Maybe it would make a difference, you know, financially. I also did just for women that I thought would be really good at this, or just for women that I thought, you know what, she loves, loves, loves great skin, this would be a good opportunity for her. So go through and make your frank list for those women and little triggers to help you. You can go look on your Facebook uh, friends list, you can pull up your contact list on your cell phone, and then just think of different people, right? Who do you know that would love this? Who do you know? And don't prejudge because we don't know kind of what's going on in their lives. We don't know. Women join beauty control for so many different reasons and women that join as shoppers turn into these crazy amazing spa girls because we know when you love a product and you're using it and you're seeing results on your skin, your girlfriends are going to ask about it. So that's the kind of house. Then ways to sort of get the products out there, right? So we know the spa is number one, right? You spa, you're gonna demo those items in the kit. If you're focusing, you can see the kits right behind me actually in my home, they're always out there. Um, if you are focusing on that $55 kit, spa with those four items, get women using those products. Pack those items in your purse. You can have those four teeny little items in your purse and you can demo all four of those at a ball field, hockey rink, ballet recital, at the gym, wherever you go, but have those items with you all the time so that you're able to quickly put them on, right? Carry mascara wands everywhere you go. Um, another way is a traveling basket. If you, you know, you don't have a spa scheduled, you can get those products out in to your girlfriends in a traveling basket. She can try it for two or three nights. Amazing results. One-on-one -on -one consultations. Bring them to your house. Go to their house. Meet them, you know, in a restaurant, wherever you want to go. But get the products on the women. If you don't have spas on your calendar, have a wine and wrinkles night in your own home. I do these all the time and my girlfriends love to come. They don't, you know, they may not want to host, but they sure want to come hang out and be able to have great results on their skin. So another great thing is a mascara challenge. Uh, challenge yourself today to go out and put mascara on 10 people because we know that mascara rocks. It's the best mascara in the world. So challenge yourself to do that. So uh, also just reach out, let women know, give them a call. Like, hey, you know what? I was thinking about you. I, you have amazing makeup and I know you'd love our mascara. Or I was thinking about you because you were super outgoing and I think you would be really good at what I do. I know you would be fabulous at it. I was thinking about you because your husband just lost his job and I think that I've got this really great opportunity that you're gonna need to look into because it is fabulous and I know it will help you. But reach out to those women, right? So now some of the uh, words, I like to really keep it, love them where they're at. So if they're about the product, love them there, right? Talk to them about the product. They can love better products, better quality products than they've been using and they can love them at better prices. Why wouldn't you? It's not who wants this, but who doesn't want this. Everyone wants this. So they can love the products. Maybe it's someone that needs to get out of the house. Maybe it's someone that needs some girl time. Maybe it's someone that needs some positive, wonderful interaction in her life. Maybe she needs some money. But there's all these reasons. We know there's so many different reasons why women join beauty control. So make sure that you're talking to them about all those different reasons. Listen, know what they want, and then kind of roll with that, right? Some of the things that have been working for our team, obviously we do challenges. I'm such a challenge girl. I love challenges myself, so I always do them for my team. So, you know, challenge yourself. Phone five people today that you've been thinking about. Challenge yourself to demo that mascara on 10 people today. Demo type firm and fill eye on 10 different eyes. But if you challenge yourself and you set challenges for your team, they're gonna rise to that challenge. Make sure that you're sharing your verbiage, make sure that you're sharing your excitement and your passion because that is why women are drawn to us and drawn to our company. 
Um, lead by example, right? We all know that why we are here is because we love the products. People have joined our team, so make sure that you're leading by example and continue to do this. Um, we always do a lot of talking about and a lot of recognition. So when someone does a great job, I am so all about that. I'm so excited and, and I like them to share. Okay, you know, Mary, you recruited so-and-so. Tell us how you did it. Tell us why she joined. Tell us about her, right? So make sure that you're sharing your passion. Make sure that you're really getting out there and getting the products on the women. Pack those four items. Biggest tip, pack those four items in your purse and everywhere you go, demo them and you will build your team. And, you know, reach out. Connecting Hearts has been giving us a huge, huge reason to kind of pick up the phone and reach out to friends and family all across your country and all across North America. It's kind of cool because we can cross reach out right through Canada and the US so um, and Puerto Rico of course so make sure you're reaching out utilize this and I hope some tips helped you and just keep on rocking your business like you know you can enjoy